Hey guys, it's Sims and Wins, and I'm here. Hey guys, it's Sims and Wins. So I'm here at um, this Nether Fortress, and um, this is right near our portal. Okay, um, I'm pretty sure I've harvested this. All oh, right, I did replant it. I replanted it. Uh, let's replant it again so we can get more. Um, so I've been working on expanding. Um, certain areas of this fortress to get some wither skulls um, and I haven't been getting any because I don't have looting um, three on my sword and I want to get it but um, you know that skeleton farm has been you know it's just too slow it's whoa whoa what is going on here Ooh, got hit right in the face right in the face okay okay Mr. Blaze you're lucky you're right next to a zombie Otherwise, I would have eaten you by now, but... Uh, I just put my daughter to bed. Ooh, look, look, they're coming. I just put my daughter to bed, so I'm talking a little softly, as usual. If you guys ever wonder why I talk so like this, it's because my daughter is sleeping right above me. So, um, you know, out of consideration for my daughter sleeping, I talk softly. Um, where are those wither, wither guys? Where are they exactly? Hmm. There they are. Okay. Um. All right. We're gonna get them. We're gonna get them. We're gonna get them. Boom. Boom. Did you drop a skull? No. Of course you didn't. Cause I don't have looting three. My chances of you guys dropping skulls are really, really, really pathetic. Um. Yeah. No skulls. All right. So where did I expand this? I could have sworn I did so much work, but I can't find exactly where it is. Let me find it. I'll be right back. All right, here we go. Now I know where I am. Um, let's just get rid of these annoying dudes. I should probably start with the blaze. Mr. Blaze over there, you're being a little rude. Mr. Blaze. All right. Um, let's pick up drops. XP, because I need the XP. So basically what I was saying was the skeleton farm is so slow, and I want to build the blaze um, farm just because, you know, it, for what I want, all the digging that I need to do and stuff, hmm. Oh, where the skeletons have spawned. Interesting. Okay, for all the digging that I need to do and stuff, um, I need to make a blaze spawner. And um, I need to also because, you know, to fight the wither, you need potions and stuff. And I just don't have the amount of blaze rods and blaze powder and all that blaze nonsense necessary in order to make a good amount of potions. So it's in my interest to do this blaze farm for the XP so I can get looting three and get my picks back. By the way, my picks broke um, because they got too expensive to repair. So I just let them break. And um, now I need new picks. I'm using a really bad pick. I'm embarrassed to show you. Efficiency two and breaking three. And breaking two. Um, I'm kind of wishing it was on breaking three. Okay. Um, so we're going to work... We're going to work on making this um, blaze spawner. Um, it's just going to be a really simple farm. I'm not even going to work on making them like one hit kills or something. We're just going to funnel them into a little pyramid. And, you know, just like, you know, whoa. Just like people always did. Okay. Nothing that's a big deal. What am I trying to say? We're going to make them into a pyramid. Okay. We're going to kill them all in once. And that'll be that. So I'm here um, building this blaze spawner. Um, it's just your regular upside down pyramid. We're gonna get the blazes all in one place and then we're just gonna kill them with our sword. That's all it's gonna be. Very, very simple um, blaze farm. So uh, right now I'm just trying to finish up this room, this initial room that we put them in. It's nine by nine by three. Um, and um, they're kind of eating my face, but it's okay, I got this. I got this. I do have armor, but I need to prepare that chest plate at some point. Alright, this shouldn't be spawning in here. It should be like completely light in here. Why are they still spawning in here? Right? I don't think they should be able to spawn in here. Right? Are blades supposed to be spawning in here? Are they affected by light levels? I think they are. Right? What? I guess, I guess not. Okay, um, I thought they were, but I guess not. 
All right, so let's get out of this room. This should be all, oh, wait, no, I need a, a half slab on top of this. All right, so now we're good. So which way is my stuff? This is my stuff. All right, so we can get out of this room. Oh, dear. Almost, almost did not see this guy. Let's see, will we get, oh, this is working very well. Almost too well. This little platform I have here, I made it. Specifically for this person purpose. Even though I, I'm not getting any skulls because they don't have looting. Hmm. Let's get the rest of these guys. Might as well. Ooh, they're all running towards me. That's kind of scary. These guys are actually pretty scary. Like I would say one of the scariest mobs in Minecraft besides the wither. The wither's pretty scary too. Um, but yeah, those guys are kind of scary. Anyway. So this is the room. Um, you know, I might regret making this on top of a giant pool of lava. Just might. Just may. May regret doing this. Um, but it's okay. It's okay. We'll be fine. Uh, let me just find the center in here now. I need to find where the nice center is. Where's my spawner? Okay, where's my spawner? Is this my spawner? No. This is not my spawner. Let's go further in. Oh, this is dangerous. This is making me nervous. That's not my spawner, okay. Is this my spawner? No. Where is the spawner? Sorry. I gotta do like my little like Long Island accent sometimes, you know, when I'm playing Minecraft. It just comes out. I don't know. If anybody's from Long Island, I hope you're not offended. I hope you're not offended. Um, hmm. Let's see. All right, let me get these little layers set up and then I'll come back. All right, I'm starting the layers of my pyramid. Honestly, I'm so glad that part of this was on like one of the, the pillars here. Otherwise, this would have been so hard. But um, only part of it is like a part of these pillars. So I do need to fill in some brick sometimes, but um, it definitely does make it easier. Oh, this is this is this is very nerve-wracking. You can hear those stupid blazes above me making so much noise, and they're like making me nervous. Okay, because I'm like afraid that I'm gonna like mistake the noise from up there coming from somewhere else. I'm gonna like jump or something. I don't know. I don't know. Just ignore me. All right. Um, I think so. This has to be three down, right? I, as far as I remember from how this works. So, um, you have the first layer, then you dig three down, and then you do the second layer, then you dig three down. It's a big pain in the butt. Um, right? Is that three down though, right? One, two, three. Right? That should be how it is. And then you're supposed to go, like, another ring around, but I don't have, I don't have anything down here. Oh wait, I do. I think it's over here. Yeah, there we go. Alright. So this is the next ring around I think I'm supposed to do. Mm hmm and then it should end up with a 3x3 center or something like that. Um, alright. Let's just try not to die, okay? That's my mission here. Try not to die. Um, alright, so you're supposed to go three down. Do I have room to go? One, two, three. Alright, I, I lived. Let's, let's go down. Um, okay. I think that's my edge, right? Yeah. Okay. So that should be that for here. How is everybody doing? Is everybody doing great? Honestly, I'm so nervous. Like right here is where it ends, so I need to fill in the rest of the blocks. It's fine, you can do it. We're gonna be careful, we're shift clicking. And we're gonna fill these blocks in nice and easy. That's all. Alright, I think that's it. I think that, that, that let's just double check one. Wait a minute. I was supposed to go three down, wasn't I? One, two, three. Wait a minute. One, two, three. One, two. Oh, okay, right, right, right. Okay, sorry, I'm done. That was a derp. Right? One, two, three. Right? Was it dig three down with this in mind, or was it dig three down, like an extra three down? Now I'm confused. Oh, wait. Did I do. I think I went one too high over here. Ugh. Wait a minute, I don't remember if it was dig three like in total or if it was dig another three down. Because this is three total and this is four total. Oh, uh, I should probably refresh on the internet or something. Let me go refresh. 
So I definitely screwed it up. It's supposed to be three blocks total. So this is three blocks. Um, so yeah, that was a big whoops. Um, which means that this is going to be one block higher. Which then means that, um, you okay, that this is going to be one block higher, right? And then I should be left with a three by three, three by three. All right, great. So that one, two, three, wait, wait a minute. One, two, three, one, two, three. Is it just me or another rack? Is like weird to look at. Nether brick, I mean. One, it's like not symmetrical. One, two, three. Okay, we're okay. This is how it's supposed to be, guys. Okay, I'm not retarded. All right. So then, okay, we have one more layer to do. Um, let's see, what am I trying to do here? Right, I do need to go three down again. Right, one, two, and then three. Do I have? Okay, I do have the room to do so. Oh man, this lava right under me is making me so nervous. So nervous. Oh, wait a minute. Was I supposed to do that? No. I wasn't supposed to dig everything. Hold on. Like that, that was supposed to stay right there. I think. Right? Wait. I'm so confused. What did I do? No, 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 no. You know, I wish I was smart. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. So this is going to be where the blaze dropped down. And that should be that, right? Um, yeah, that should be that. Okay. Uh, I think it's time to start putting the pistons in and stuff. Um, how do I get out now? I guess we're going to just tunnel up. I need to go get my pistons and stuff from my chest over there. Ugh. More blocks to remove. Any scary things around me? No. Alright, pistons, redstone, repeaters, pressure plates, anything else I need? Mm, no? Don't think so. Alrighty. Okay, let's try not to die now. Uh, we're gonna put in the pistons. I'll, maybe I'll show you a little bit of how I do it, and then uh, I'll do it off camera so we can finish this quickly. Alright, so this is the setup. Um, you have the pistons, right? I have them encased from the outside so no gas can get them. You have your pressure plates. The reason why you alternate um, the repeaters with the redstone is so that each one um, extends separately so the signal doesn't connect. Otherwise, you know, if you put all redstone, you know, all of them will extend at the same time. It's just pointless. So, uh, yeah, I just repeat this on all sections. You know, this is the first section, second section, third section. I'm considering doing this one too. Um, it's not really necessary, but I'll think about it. And uh, yeah, I'll get back to you. So I ran out of another brick down here, so I just used my stone brick. It's fine. It's okay. So um, the last thing to do is I need to put blocks on these things. And I don't have enough building blocks. So I need to get out of this room real quick. Grab some more supplies. And then... Um, come back. Maybe I have more nether brick or I can go get some. Ooh. Yeah, I need to get some nether brick. So we're just... Ooh. Jeez. Louise, what is going on here? Well, you guys are having a party outside while I'm building? You see, if, are you mad that I've imprisoned your friends? I've imprisoned your friends and your spawner. Hmm. Alright. We're gonna grab some of this nether brick. And um, it'll be fine. Um, yeah. Alright, I went and I got some more um, nether brick and finished this off nice and neatly. So, the last step I want to do now is to just tower up from the center and place our um, locks on the sticky piston so that um, the blaze can move. Um, otherwise, right now, obviously, since there's nothing attached to it, they won't actually go anywhere. Um, so that's the last step for now. And then we just prepare the killing room. We should probably at some point work on a, a smoother way to get here rather than running through the nether like maniacs. And um, maybe I should make a portal to this room. I also need to decide whether this room up here, whether I would put more pressure plates over here. I kind of want to. Uh, it would mean going back to the overworld and getting more more materials, I mean, but I don't know. It just feels very lazy 
waiting for them to move down. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Ah, uh, yeah. Let me just finish up some last touches. I need to take out the ceiling, prepare the bottom, you know. Alright, so let me show you some progress that we've finally made on this slime farm. Um, it's actually working pretty okay. It's I'm not done yet at all. I just finished digging it out. Um, the one, the space that's below Y40 is going to be slime farm. The space above, I think I'm going to turn to like some kind of kelp farm. I think it'll be pretty. Um, and it will cover up with glass and you'll be able to look from the um, outside, from the upstairs in. Where is this coming from? There it is. There's our slime. Alrighty. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, I feel like every time I come down here, I always see like two slimes. Um, I think the more I light up caves, the more I, um, obviously I don't do any FKing. I just kind of run by. Uh, if I AFK a little bit and finally finish the farm, finish the setup and the automatic killing system, I'm pretty sure this will work great and I'll have more slime balls than I'll ever need. Um, the rate's pretty good though. Uh, without having done much lighting up, um, ever since, you know, we went to the backup, um, you know, a lot of the caves that I had previously discovered are undiscovered now, so, uh, I do have some lighting up to do, but, uh, it's doing pretty good. Also, more, um, more progress, um, so the cactus farm is all done, um, as you can see, I, I don't know if I showed you last episode, I might have, but let me just review. That, oh, oh, this is full already. Well, geez, Louise, that's a lot of cactus. That's a very full cactus farm. I need to like, get these funneling. The thing is, I don't want to, okay, I know I should get them funneling into like a smelter, but I don't want to be doing a smelter yet because, you know, the blast furnace is coming out in 1.14. You know, I don't want to do anything with a smelter until I figure out like how much more efficient the blast furnace is and whether you can automate that like i feel like that's what i'm waiting for so yeah just a little bit of patience wait i'm sure you're confused the reason why i came back here is because i decided to make more sticky pistons and more pressure plates because i decided i'm gonna actually do that top layer that top layer is kind of optional because sometimes the the blazes will idle there and sometimes they won't but you know i decided i I don't want any, I want this to be as max efficiency as possible. So I'm going to build the top layer with the pressure plates. It'll be more expensive, but. All right, so we're all good to go. Everything is complete. The pyramid is closed. All the pistons have been put in. Everything has been set. So all the redstone's done. So all we need to do is sit in our AFK spot, which is right here. And this is a little bit, you know, temporary, okay? We're going to make this nice and, you know, pop in in a bit, okay? Maybe in a couple episodes? Not yet. I need to work on getting my gear and getting this looting three sword, getting a beacon and all that other stuff. We have so much to do, so much to do. All right, so I'm going to sit here for a bit. We'll kick some butt and then probably do some enchanting. All right, let's see what we got. We got a little temporary setup here. Uh, like 27-ish, probably blazes here um let's swipe them swipe 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 boom and that's how the cookie crumbles ladies and gentlemen mm -mm -mm. all my blaze rods go in here awesome see it's, it's just as simple as that it's i just wanted something simple you guys understand i just really wanted something simple that's all all right guys i have done a ton of building off camera and um, I think I'm going to end this part here, but let me just show you guys. Um, over here is the cactus farm that I built. This is the wheat farm. This is carrots, potatoes, um, beetroot, and then on top is nether wart. And I'm going to link it all up so that we can um, actually, s I have it hooked up to dispensers that dispense water all the way down. I'm going to finish up the redstone off camera. And then there's a collection system over there. Um, so this is basically almost done. I will show you how it works next episode. Next episode, we'll tear this out. We'll work on a stairwell, sort of how we get up to every um, module here. And we'll work on the bottom of this because we do need to you know, have it sitting on something. I'm going to finish up the slime farm also off camera. And this episode, we also built our, um, blaze farm. So, uh, we're, we're being productive. Um, this is going to get torn out and replaced and they might move. It might go somewhere else. We'll just rebuild the animal farm somewhere else. It's been like a lot of tearing out, rebuilding things, but I'm kind of happy with this. I kind of think it reminds me of Ikea 
Like it's like an Ikea farming module system. It's really funny. Um, so we'll finish that up, but, uh, we got a lot done this episode. So, um, happy new year. Cause right now it's, it's, uh, January 3rd. So happy new year. This has been in the recording for a long time, like a month, maybe more, but I just really wanted to get this built because it's been taking so long to get this series like started. Like we haven't really done a whole lot yet. So, um, yeah, I hope you have a great day or night, whatever it is in your part of the world. Take care and bye-bye.